So in question number 99, we have to look for the option which is incorrect with respect to the photosynthesis. Uh, first option, yes, only 10% of full sunlight is required to perform the maximum photosynthesis. So this statement is right. Uh, second one is related to carbon dioxide. You know that for the C3 plants, carbon dioxide is a limiting factor. So if we will increase the concentration of the carbon dioxide, so this will surely increase the productivity of C3 plants. One good example for that is tomato and bell pepper where we can try this. Now, so this statement is also correct. Now coming to the third option, C3 plants respond to higher temperature with enhanced photosynthesis. This is wrong statement. Yes, for the C3 plants, maximum photosynthesis occur at the lower temperature optima and for the C4 plants, the maximum photosynthesis occurs at the higher temperature optima. You have to keep this in mind that in the case of the C4 plants, one enzyme gets inactivated at lower temperature that is PEP synthetase, the one which is involved in the synthesis of phosphoenol pyruvate, right? Now, coming to the fourth option, tomato is a greenhouse crop. Yes, it is a C3 plant. If we will increase the concentration of the carbon dioxide, this will surely increase the yield of tomato. So, this is again right option. So, the incorrect option here is option number 3. So, answer is 3 here. So, now let's discuss 100 question. <coughs> 